discussion is looming as to whether or not Jamie Kloss's alleged kidnapper will go to trial. Jake Patterson charged with homicide, kidnapping, armed robbery, and he was moved to a Polk County jail today. One of Jamie's relatives actually works at the Barron County Jail, but the sheriff in Barron County called the transfer and administrative decision. Our Jamie Perez spoke with legal experts today on this case. She joins us now with some possible outcomes. Jamie? That's right. Well, as of right now, we don't know if this case will make it to trial, depending on what Patterson's plea will be, but in speaking with the defense attorney this afternoon, there could be additional charges pending in Douglas County, in which case Jamie Kloss may have to testify, and some of the statements made by Patterson in that criminal complaint could be thrown out if they were not obtained in a proper manner. He has a right to a jury trial. Jake Thomas Patterson is facing charges of homicide, kidnapping, and armed robbery. While he made his first court appearance yesterday, the question remains, what happens next? People are presumed to be innocent until proven otherwise, and so it could be a situation where they're going in and telling the prosecution to prove the case. If Patterson pleads not guilty and this goes to trial... Can they draw a jury that is impartial? If this case does go to trial, Patterson's defense attorneys would take on the task of reviewing police reports and seeing if the information was obtained properly. If for any reason Patterson's statements were not obtained properly. Or are there reasons, an ability, a legal ability to have his statements thrown out of court? The charges filed against Patterson right now pertain to Barron County. If there are additional charges pending in Douglas County where Patterson home was. Depending on what the sentence is, there may be a decision not to charge the other offenses because the additional time in a practical matter doesn't make a difference on the outcome. If charges are filed in Douglas County, Patterson could potentially go to trial and be sentenced there as well. Although Tim Verhoff doesn't think that would be a likely outcome, especially if it meant putting Jamie Kloss on the stand. Things that happened after she was kidnapped aren't necessarily relevant to the, the murders and the kidnapping. Um, so those are things that, yeah, you, you don't necessarily want to have to, as a prosecutor, a victims get up and talk about that have no bearing on the outcome of the underlying case. And the last question that many of us might be wondering, what if Patterson pleads insanity? I don't think this case is an insanity case. He went to such great lengths to conceal his identity, so that shows that he had a knowledge that what he was doing was wrong. The Douglas County District Attorney's Office was not able to comment on what, if any, additional charges could be filed against Patterson, as this is, of course, an ongoing investigation. Patterson's next court appearance is February 6th, so we will provide updates as they become available then. And a long legal process ahead, both in Barron County and potentially Douglas yeah, we're County a long as way well. From trial, for Jamie, sure. thank you very much. Mm -hmm. Missing